Well, you know, sometimes you kind of have to break the, the rules. I ordinarily I, I don't like to spread rumors, but this this one is just it's just too good not to not to not to share. Okay, now I want to stress it's just it's just a rumor, but I just I just read this press release on my computer, and I made a copy of it and. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to share it with you, if you'll allow me to, okay? Um, <laughs> I kind of chuckled when I read the headline. It says, Lindsay Lohan rumored to be starting her own affiliate marketing company. Now, can you believe that? It goes on to say, it seems that Lindsay has more than her share of challenges in trying to live life on life's terms. Uh, however, Lindsay is a survivor, and it's rumored that Lindsay plans to start her own online affiliate marketing company from prison. <laughs> the details are still sketchy at this time, but but it appears that she will be selling a series of instructional videos on the following subjects. Uh, it looks like she's going to pass the time while she's doing time by doing videos. Can you get that? Oh, my golly. Anyhow, uh, the subjects uh, apparently are as follows. And she's going to be selling these through her network. Can you believe that? Here are the subjects. How to survive drug and alcohol addictions as a teenager. And and let me see. It's a better copy over here. Um, how to survive the illegal use of alcohol, drugs, and cocaine as a teenager. How to party hardy till the cows come home. How to get free three trips to rehab resorts. How to con the rehab into believing that you're cured in order to get an early release despite a court-ordered 90-day stay. And I love this one. How to explain to people that denial is not a river in Egypt. And this one's pretty good, too. How to be accused of stealing a $400,000 necklace, a $12,000 mink coat, a $12,000 Rolex, and manage to escape prosecution and conviction. And how to get two DUIs without losing your license and avoiding any penalty. And how to thumb your nose at a judge and violate probation and blow off court appearances and essentially get away with it scot-free and how to convince a jewelry store that you really just borrowed that $2,500 necklace and intended to bring it back and how to really a judge with your good judgment by going to court outfitted in a tight white mini skirt Shoes and accessories worth approximately $14,000. Now, apparently she has not figured out how she's going to compensate her affiliates for the referrals yet. However, she states that she's confident that the Lindsay Lohan network will be a huge success. Now, in case... In case you ain't figured it out yet, this is kind of a little spoof, or my idea of a spoof. Because as a, as a recovered alcoholic and drug addict myself, I just, I, I couldn't resist writing this. And as a recovered person myself who's been there, I can, I can kind of relate to Lindsay and sympathize with her. And in all seriousness, substance abuse, alcohol and drugs, and behavior addictions 
um, like kleptomania, uh, are serious, are serious matters. And I also I had to learn that you can't change other people. You know, people have to reach their, their own conclusions themselves. So, you know, one day, uh, one day they wake up and they come to grips with their denial and they decide at, to turn their life over to a higher power. And in this situation, I hope, my hope is for Lindsay that that happens sooner rather than later. And y'all have a good day now here. Bye.